upstairs and downstairs, and we have science labs down there as well. And <laughs> so the chapel is really awesome. I miss the chapel. We have a prayer garden over here. The students that just wanted some alone time, and, you know, peaceful alone time. So let's see. This is the science building. The science building right now is not being used. The only thing that's being used in the science building is the uh, biology. Six majors here at Paul King. We have biology, we have uh, business, man business management, and business accounting. We have business administration, computer science, legal studies. I'm a legal studies major. every year and it's like huge you know it's just like homecoming homecoming it's huge actually Paul Quinn uh, was in the top 10 homecomings for HBCUs and he also voted in the magazine he didn't win but uh, it's an honor um, so yeah we have you got your picture? Uh -huh. oh you take it <laughs> um, so yeah, we have the big pots over here and Right here is our Liberty Bell. The Liberty Bell is the only piece of the original campus that started in Austin. Uh, Paul Quinn started in Austin in 1872 and then later moved to Waco in 1882. So it was in Austin for about 10 years and it stayed in Waco in the uh, single building campus for hundreds of years and it finally moved here to Dallas in 1990. Mm -hmm. Now we've been here for 20, 21 years and the school gets better every year. Uh, a lot of the problems that we had and different things that we had, we, it started here um, after we moved and took over Bishop College. And the reason that we moved here initially is because you know the opportunities that you can receive and the different things that you can get in Dallas. Campus, I skipped the stage, but stay over there. That's <laughs> <laughs> Rose. <laughs> to your left is the Omega plot. So, if you want to know anything about Omega, you can ask Mr. Ed Knox. <laughs> so, let's step up. So, yeah, like I was saying, uh, we moved to Dallas because of the opportunities that the students had more than they had in Waco, more than they had in Austin. Mm -hmm. Now, I'm actually a witness to those opportunities, and not only the opportunities that we get in Dallas, the opportunities that we get in at Paul Quinn, period. Like, I'm a student, but I'm a full-time employee as well. Mm -hmm. And this is the first time it's been done here to where I'm an enrollment management officer, and that's my internship for the semester. You know what I'm saying? I'm getting 12 credit hours for that. And taking one other class on the 15th. But, you know, that's what I do. And that's what that's the beauty of Paul Quinn. We're a small school, so if you got talent, if you got, you know, gifts, if you got things that you can do, you can shine. And they will make you shine. So let's go in here. This is uh, And this attributes to 
plenty of different offices and uh, places where students can go. This right here, first of all, is becoming our new weight room. This is our bookstore, but they uh, took all the books out and are now going to make it our weight room. We're going to have mirrors, you know, all over to make it look like a regular weight room. We have a newly renovated weight room, but they need bigger space because it's, I mean, we have uh, the new basketball team really taking over and we, uh, we want more space. A lot of students are going to utilize the weight room. So. Over here, across the weight room, we have one of our second of our third uh, free tutoring center. So this is our dean of students, Kessel Thompson. Hi, how are you? Good. Mr. Evans, how are you? Ma'am, this is the student support services tutoring center and uh, counseling center. So basically... Hi, welcome. <laughs> <laughs> how are you? Hi, <laughs> so basically, this is one of the places yeah, where you know get more no, extra tutoring. Hi, how are you, Jonathan? Nice, nice to meet you. Meet you. Yeah. I do too. I like what it. Here. Uh, what part of Cali? What's that like? Um, what's that like? Mm -hmm. okay, so, what do you think you want to major in? Computer science. Doctor Rockpot is really good in computer science. So, and like a business program. So. Mm -hmm. I'd like to meet with them before I leave too. The, the computer science advisor, if that's um, possible, just to would, know. It would actually be the um, science person. Let's ask Dexter if we can set up an appointment. I, why don't I send an email to him? Mm -hmm. Are you going to be here all day? Will we? Uh, Pretty much. Pretty much. Mm -hmm. I'm going to send him um, to call him. But faculty are not always here every day. Okay. What about Dean Thompson? Dean Thompson? Mm -hmm. This right here? Mm -hmm. oh, okay, good, good, good. Yeah, so. good so this is a fun area. Uh, we have workshops here, and um, Siemens came in and did a really deep presentation with some CAD software. Um, we um, just got back from San Antonio and Austin mm -hmm. about 15 students, and it's 